ವಂದೆ ಗುರುಪದ್ವಂದ ಭಕ್ತವಿಂದ ಸಮನ್ವಿತ ಶ್ರೀಚೈತನ್ಯ ಪ್ರಭು ವಂದೆ ನಿತ್ಯನಂದ ಸಹೋದಿತ ಶ್ರೀನಂದನಂದನ ವಂದೇ ರಾಧಿಕ ಚರಣದ ಗೋಪೀಜನ ಸಮಯುಕ್ತ ಬಿಂದಾ ಮನೋಹರ ವಾಂಶಾಕಲ್ಪತರು ವಶ ಕಿ ಪಾಸಿಂಧು ವ್ಯವಶ ಪತಿ ಪಾವನೇಭ್ಯ ವೈಷ್ಣವೇಭ್ಯೋ ನಮೋ ನಮ ಮೂಕಂ ಕರೋತಿ ವಾಚಾಲ ಪಂಗು ಲಂಘಿರಿ ಜತ್ ಕಿ ಪಾತಮಹಂಗವಂದಿ ಪರಮಾನಂದಮಾಧವ ಬಿಂದಾವಿ ತುಳಸಿದೆ ವೈ ಪಿಯಾವೈ ಕೇಶವ ಶ್ನಭಕ್ತಿ ಪದೇ ದೇವಿ ಸತ್ವತ್ವೈ ನಮೋ ನಮ ನಾರಾಯಣ ನಮಸ್ಕೃತ ನರುಂಜೈವ ನರುತ್ತಮ ದೇವಿ ಸರಸ್ವತಿ ವ್ಯಾಸ ತೋ ಜಯೋ ಮುಧೀರ ಸಂಕೀರ್ತನೆ ಕೃಷ್ಣ ಕಥೋಪದೇಶ ಗೌರೀಯ ಪತ್ರಶ್ಯ ಪ್ರಕಾಶನೆ ಸದಾನುರಕ್ತ ಗುರುಭಕ್ತಿ ಯುಕ್ತ ಭಕ್ತಿ ಪ್ರಮೋದಾಕ್ಷ ಜಗೋದ್ವರನ್ ಧ್ಯ ಸದಾ ಪರಿಭವಗ್ನ ವಿಷ್ಟದೂಹಂ ತೀರ್ಥಾಸ್ಪದ ಶಿವಿರಿಂಚನು ತರನ್ನ ಭೀತಾತ್ಯಹಂ ಪುನತಪಾಲ್ಯಭವಾಧಿಪೂತ ವಂದೇ ಮಹಾಪುರುಷ ತೆ ಚರುಣಾರಭಿಂದ ಯತ್ಪಾದಲ್ಲವಲಕಚಂದಮನಿ ಛಟಾಯ ವಿಸ್ಫುರಜೀತ ಕಿಮಿ ಗೋಪೂಷು ಅದರ್ಶ ಪೂರ್ಣಾನುರಾಗರ ಸ್ವಸಾಗರ ಸಾರಮೂರ್ತಿ ಸಾರಾಧಿ ಕಾಮಯಿ ಕದಾ ಕಿಂ ಕರೋಷ್ಟಿ ಶ್ರೀ ಕೃಷ್ಣ ಚೈತನ್ಯ ಪ್ರಭು ನಿತ್ಯಾನಂದ ಶ್ರೀ ಅದ್ವೈತ ಗದಾಧರ ಶಿವ ಸದಿ ಗೌರಭಕ್ತ ಶ್ರೀ ಕೃಷ್ಣ ಚೈತನ್ಯ ಪ್ರಭು ನಿತ್ಯಾನಂದ ಶ್ರೀ ಅದ್ವೈತ ಗದಾಧರ ಶಿವ ಸದಿ ಗೌರಭಕ್ತ ಹರೇ ಕೃಷ್ಣ ಹರೇ ಕೃಷ್ಣ 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 ಹರೇ 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 ರಾಮ ಹರೇ ರಾಮ 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 ಹರೇ ಅಜಾನುಲಂಬಿತ ಭುಜೌ ಕನುಕಾಬದಾತು ಸಂಕೀರ್ತನ ಕವಿತರೌ ಕಮಲ ಯಥಾಕ್ಷ ಭೀಶಾಂಬರು ದ್ವಿಜವರು ಜುಗಧರ್ಮಪಾಲೌ ವಂದೇ ಜಗತ್ಪ್ರಿಯಕರು ಕರುಣಾಭಾರು ಹರೇ ಕೃಷ್ಣ ಹರೇ ಕೃಷ್ಣ 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 ಹರೇ 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 ರಾಮ ಹರೇ ರಾಮ 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 ಹರೇ ಹರೇ ನಮಿ ಗಂಗೆ ತವ ಪಾದ ಪಂಕಜ ಸುರಸುರೈರ್ವಂದಿಪ ಭುಕ್ತಿ ಮುಕ್ತಿ ದಿ ಭಾನುಪೇನ್ನ ಸದಾ ನರನ ಗಂಗಾತರಂಗರಮಣೀಯಜಟಕಲಾಪ ಗೌರೀ ನಿರಂತರ ವಿಭುಷಿ ತಾಮ ಭಾಗ ನಾರಾಯಣ ಪ್ರಿಯ ಮನೋಂಗ ಮದಾಪಹಾರ ವರಾನಸಿ ಪುರಪತಿ ಭಜ ವೀಶನಾಥ ವಾಗೀಶಜುಷ್ಯ ವದನೆ ಲಕ್ಷ್ಮೀರ್ಜಸ್ ಚ ಭಕ್ಷಿ ಜಸ್ಯಾಸ್ತೆ ಹೃದಯ ಸಂಬಿ ತ್ಸಿಂಗಮಹಂ ಭಜೆ ಹರೇ ಕೃಷ್ಣ ಹರೇ ಕೃಷ್ಣ 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 ಹರೇ 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 ರಾಮ ಹರೇ ರಾಮ 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 ಹರೇ ನೈಷಾಂಗಮತಿ ಸ್ಥಾವಧೂರು ಕ್ರಮಾಂಗಿ ಸ್ಪೃಶ್ಯತ್ತನರ್ಥಾಪ ಗೋಮ ಜಗರ್ಥೋ 
मही हसा पादरजोभिषेक निष्किंचनान न वृणीत जाबद नैषांगमती स्तावधुरुक्रमि स्पृशत्तनर्थापगमो जदर्थ मही हसा पादरजोभिषेक निष्किंचनान न वृणीत जाबद गौरी गोष्ठीपति श्रीशील भक्ति सिद्धांत सरस्वती गोस्वामी जगत भगवान परमहंस जगत गुरु टोल्ड दैट सो लॉन्ग एज वी आर नॉट गोइंग टू डेवलप सर्विंग टेम्परमेंट ऑन टू द लोटस पीट ऑफ निष्किंचन गुरु वैष्णव देन देर इज नो पॉसिबिलिटी देर वी कैन डेवलप भक्ति गौरी गोष्ठीपति श्रीशील भक्ति सिद्धांत सरस्वती गोस्वामी जगत प्रभा परमहंस जगत गुरु सेट दैट सो लॉन्ग एज वी आर नॉट गोइंग टू डेवलप सर्विंग टेम्परमेंट अन टू द लोट स्पीड ऑफ निष्किन चंद गुरु वैष्णव टिल दिस देर इज नो पॉसिबिलिटी ऑफ गेटिंग भक्ति एंड प्रोपा स्पीकिंग इफ दे आर एसोसिएशन इज वेरी गुड इफ यू think this kind of association material association is very good if you think this then proper speaking be sure if they are not developing that kind of serving um, temperament and temperament unto lotus feet of pure guru vishnu don't do their sangha maybe they are near and dear one your father mother friend wife maybe like ramanuja jo left his wife Pope was speaking. This is the secrecy of Hari Bhajan. In Upadesham Rita, Pope was writing. Those sahaja, they don't think it necessary. They never think it necessary to serve Guru Vishnu. Pope was speaking. They don't think. They don't think it necessary to serve Guru Vishnu. On the contrary, they demand service. they want to put you can serve me they want to speak this way so they demand service from others but they are not going to do any service to guru vishnu that's why maybe they are sitting in a solitary room and doing hari krishna hari krishna they are doing many sahaj you can from morning time they can sit they are doing japa they think they are doing perfect bhajan but pope was speaking Without developing serving temperament and to a little speed of pure Guru Vishnu, you can never get bhakti. Is not possible. And Bhagwan Singh is also speaking to Udhav. Udhav, you can see one pure devotee, always, always thinking how to deliver those bonded soul. Always thinking. Bhagwan Singh is speaking to Udhav. You can see watch. that those a pure guru is now they are always thinking how to deliver them always they are thinking how to even they want to kill him they want to kill him beat him insult him but still baba speaking bhagwan bless bhagwan bless me so that those who are thinking me their enemy those who want to kill me to think me enemy you bless me so that i never develop negative t- negative attitude for them baba thank to bhagwan they want to kill me they they think me enemy but still bhagwan you please bless me so that i never develop any negative attitude for them i never develop some some revenging attitude i can take revenge this is not the many such cases happen In the life of Prabhupada, many such cases. In Purushottam Dam, Bhakti Vinod Thakur took Bimala Prasad with him. There, not small that time, aged. There, Bhakti Vinod Thakur used to explain Chaitanya Charitamrita. Just near, you you been there, I think, Pur Puri, na, yeah. Puri. There is one place. Where Bhakti Vinod Thakur used to do bhajan, just Haridas Thakur Samadhi Mandir opposite. 
there is some place that, that is the bhajan kutir of Bhakti Vinod Thakur. He used to do bhajan. Now, it is not under our control. Bhakti Vinod Thakur wanted to give responsibility to Popad, you recite Chaitanya Bhagavatam, I am going to Calcutta for some seva. I can come back. Till then you can go. But Bhimala Pausa started explaining Chaitanya Bhagavatam, a Chaitanya Charitamrita, a very few people hearing him, all gone, not hearing him. A very few people hearing, all the rest of the people are gone, leaving him. After that, Bhakti Vinod Thakur came back and watching that day, when coming back, he watching a very few people hearing him. Then he told Bhimala Prasad, you, you, you recite Chaitanya Bhagavat today. From tomorrow I can speak. After hearing the explanation of Chaitanya, Chaitamitha, Bhakti Vinod now thinking, this kind of explanation, who can accept? Bhakti Vinod was so happy. So happy. He was thinking, so now I know why people don't like to hear you. All well, they're gone. You are speaking so absolute truth. People have no capacity to accept it. And they all took decision to kill Bhimala Prasad. They, although Sahaja Babaji's, they wanted to kill him. Whenever they get him outside, they can beat him. They took decision. The news spread. Then the news came to Bhaktivinoda Thakur. Then with heavy, with heavy heart, Bhaktivinoda Thakur was bound to speak. You go to Brajapatran, I mean here. Brajapatran, here. It is also Brajadam. Brajapatran means Chaitanya Mahat at present. The Navadip Dham, our Mayapur, go to Brajapatran. There you go and do Harinam, Nam, Nam Bhajan, first of all. So, Bhakti Mahatak giving his own. Mala, in which Bhakti Mata would done, Satakodi Nam Jagu, that Mala Bhakti Mata giving to Prabhupada. And Prabhupada taking, and somehow managed to come here in Mayapur Navadi and started doing bhajan. After that yesterday I told you, na, then Pachyatattva and everybody came, that's all. So many times it happens so. Actually, in in the life of a guru, pure Guru Vaishnava, they never find anybody enemy. They never. This is the mood of pure Guru Vaishnava. You know the case of Navadip, it is well known to you. Also in Dhaka, when the preaching of Goryama started, there was no mat. Dhaka, in Dhaka. First time Goryama preaching started. All Sahajiyas, they become very angry. They are fighting with the devotees of Gauriyamat. Baba sending them. Bhakti Vyag, Bharati Maharaj, all they are going. All they are fighting with them. They have no money. Now preaching means you should have big amount of money, but no money. Without money, only Chaitanya Bhagavad there. And they are going open field, corporation, corporation field. They are sitting, no mic, nothing. Now we have so many facilities. Open ground, corporation ground. Bhakti Vyag Bharati was sitting and started reciting Chaitanya Bhagavat. So many, so many people started coming by watching the tall figure, so nice Bhakti. All they started hearing. All they started hearing. Then Sahajiya, they took decision, well, we can... From Santipur, we invite one big, big, you know, Pandit who can recite Bhagavatam. All people going there to attend the Harikatha of Bhakti Vyag Bharti Maharaj. So we can arrange one. Then they are going to hire one man from Santipur. Santipur, big Pandit. He is going to recite Bhagavatam there. In, he is reciting Bhagavatam in the corporation field. They are in a very nice place. They are speaking Harikatha. Then in the first day, 
people started attending them. After that, they could realize that we don't know what kind of attraction like magnet Bhakti, Bhakti Vivek Bharati Maharaj. But we cannot understand what kind of magnetic attraction. Then again, come and attain his Harikatha. So they are failure. Even they pay huge amount of money. They hire that Pandit. They hire. And that Pandit was taken from Santipur to Dhaka. But still they are failure. When their plan is failure, when the Gauriyam are preaching absolute truth going on, then they are going to preach in the common society. Nobody should give even one penny to Gauriyama devotee, Gauri mission. Not even a handful of rice. Nobody. If you do, we can throw you out of your, our society. If you do, then we can, this family we can throw out of society. So out of fear they are not going. After that message came to Sila Prabhupada. Prabhupada, they took decision not to give one handful of rice, crude rice. Then how we can preach? Then Prabhupada speaking, you go on preaching by drinking the water there of Buri Ganga. Who is going to stop you drinking water from that? And let me see Nithyananda Gauranga is there or not. Then they started doing. Within one or two days, all people started coming again, giving donations. This way all Sahajiyas, they always try to make problems. Mane, Popa speaking, if you are going to make compromise with all people, then no problem. If you are going to make compromise with all other common people, then no problem. They can respect you, give garland, wash your leg. They can Whenever you start speaking absolute truth, they can start killing. They can make you target how to kill him. This is a target. All alone this is a target. Pope was speaking, this is a tragedy. Whenever you speak absolute truth, then people can attack you. They cannot bear you. If you speak lie, compromise with them. If you are doing bhajan mixed with maya, then no problem. Nobody can speak. They can help you. They can help you big way. Whenever Prahlad Maharaj started speaking about the absolute truth, then Hiranagubu started attacking. So long Prahlad Maharaj was a very nice boy. So long Prahlad Maharaj was a very nice boy. In front of Hiranagubu, very nice boy. He can take in lap, kiss him, bless him. So long as he is not going to speak about the absolute truth. You, you try to consider, you try to think. The moment he started speaking about this, the moment he started speaking about the Absolute Truth, then Hiranagu started fighting. Kill him. That is the mood of our society. How you can expect, how you can expect new, new devotees can come up? How you can expect? You are foolish. You cannot expect. At present, so... The dirty situation. This situation is very dangerous. Our Siddhanti Maharaj, you heard the name of Siddhanti Maharaj? Never heard. Who? Bhakti Sirup Siddhanti Maharaj. You don't know him. He is a great devotee of Prabhupada. After Prabhupada gone, as for the desire of Prabhupada, he, wanted, he was the first man to publish Vedanta in Gauriya Vashya. In living time, in his lifetime, Prabhupada wanted to do so many things. Day and night, Prabhupada wanted to give energy. Even at the age of 62, Prabhupada looks like a man of 80. So much energy. No prasadam, no resting. Whole day and night. After Prabhupada gone, those demons, they took all the writings of Prabhupada. All the writings. Prabhupada wrote whole life, all the time. You don't know. Whole day and night, Prabhupada writing and speaking. Whenever Prabhupada gone, those are opponent party, that they, they are deviated from Gauriyamar. They are identified, but they are totally deviated. 
they took all the writings of Prabhupada in a sack, potato sack, oh, and night time in a boat, in a boat there, and throw into inside Ganga. Follow. They throw inside Ganga. This is Maya. If those writings, if we could get so many secrecy of Bhajan, we could. But, you see, the demon in the form of devotee, all troll. Very sad, very sad. Even I got one library, historical library, that is stolen by one big Acharya. I be faith him, I believe and skip. And in there, all the diaries of Prabhupada. Diaries of Prabhupada was there. Nobody can come in favor of me to beat him. Everybody can beat me, kill me. They cannot speak in because they are money for. Cannot speak. Or stolen. Without speaking me. I come like a lever in a truck night time. Like a lever. With Gamcha here, truck all stolen. This is our society. How we can expect to get bhakti? To understand the meaning of bhakti, we'll have to spend. To understand what is the meaning. So confusion all around. Only dry philosophy is not bhakti. That Siddhanti Maharaj mean to say. All our society knows who has stolen, but they cannot see. They can cooperate him. I wrote them later. They you promise me, after I arrange the library, you can give me copy. Even copy. But now you'll, we cannot give. I said, okay. Nityananda Prabhu there, he can judge. This is condition. But still I am bearing. After so much torture, so much opposite, but still I am surviving by the desire of Nityananda. The Siddhanti Maharaj, Siddhanti Maharaj, he was the first devotee, man, first, who, trans, who wanted to publish all the Bhasya of Vedanta and Gaudiya Vasya. Commentary, different. Popat wanted to do, but lifetime, there was no time. Upanishad and Vedanta. He was the first man to do all. He used to respect Bhakti Vivek Bharati Maharaj as his Siksha Guru. As his Siksha Guru. So some of his disciples, I mean Bhakti Vivek Bharati Maharaj disciple, after Bharati Maharaj gone, Maharaj give all the responsibility of temple to Siddhanti Maharaj. You become Acharya. You are the fittest person. Sit. But they cannot be here. Everywhere, politics everywhere. Free of plot politics. If you can see me, if you can show me one place which is free of politics, I can leave all Khafar. One place you can show me. There is no politics. Everywhere, dirty politics. We identify, we are the devotees in the line of Gauri Amat. We are in the line of Chaitanya Mahaprabhu. It's not that. Siddhanti Maharaj was so tough. Some sannyasi, two or three sannyasis, they took sannyas from Maharaj. Okay? After taking sannyas, they are getting association of widow. Widow, you know, widow. They are going to their house. Siddhanta Maharaj took information. Right? They are sannyasi. Why they are going there? Siddhanta said, you cannot go there. You have no right to go there. Even one Sannyasi, one devotee, should not do anything which is not wrong. Still, still can develop some suspicion. Follow. Suppose I am not doing any wrong. Still, you suspect from long distance. Oh, Maharaj, doing this. This is also prohibited. But to speak about bhakti, pure bhakti. I am not doing any wrong. But for long distance, from long distance, you misunderstand me. Oh, Maharaj is doing this. Talking with one Mataji. Okay. That even I cannot give any chance. 
Even that kind of chance I cannot give any people to speak anything. And they can attack me on, on some other ground. But they cannot find any chance so that they can attack me. They are searching. They are keeping a close watch on me. They are searching one opportunity they can attack. So, Pahupad, it was the nature of Pahupad. Even you have no scope to pass any bad river about Pahupad. You can speak all rubbish. That is up to you. Then Maharaj speaking, you have no right to go there because you have taken sannyas. But still they are going. Then after that, Maharaj called them and taking all sannyas, kapar, forcefully, tear. Maharaj was so healthy, taking the sannyas clothes and tear. Go outside. You have no right to keep sannyas. After that, what happens? It was winter season. Maharaj was sleeping. Room is open. Vaishnavas did never fear anybody. They are open. They are not money. After putting, they are not clocking. Open. You go, you can see. Any Vaishnava, they don't believe on money. Money is open. How much you need? Take from here. Count and take. They don't care. After that, what, am, what happens? That day, that devotee, one devotee, one, one that so-called sannyasi, he took one carter, carter, night time. Maharaj putting kambal, whole body, winter season, sleeping, and with the, with the chopper, carter, forcefully. And after that, run away from the room. And Maharaj get up, wow, get up. By chance, that day, Maharaj, by the desire of Bhagavan, put his head opposite side. They know Maharaj putting head this side. I don't know why. By chance, that day, why I don't know, Maharaj put head that side. That's why leg already cut and blood coming out, force. Devotion. How much? How much perseverance you should have, how, dumb, how much enduring power you should have, Bhagavan testing. Bhagavan can burn you. Bhagavan can burn you fire. You like to do bhakti? You like to come to me? Eh? Okay, come to me. I can burn you. I can see how much power you have to. You think it's a joking. Bhakti is joking. Ah, very easy. Bhagavan can burn you. After taking to his dham. Not so easy. Then after that, blood coming out continuously. Maharaj could see, recognize, though he, he was wearing monkey cap, Maharaj immediately got up and saw that man running away. Maharaj could see. After the Sama, all devotees coming, treatment was there. Finally, somehow Maharaj recovered. And then the police case was there. On, the, on behalf of temple, they filed case. After that, opponent pleader and his friend. There. And after that man, who was detected, suspect, suspected he was put in the, in front of lawyer, in front of judge. And our Siddhanti marriage is one side, and that man that side. Who wanted to kill, attempt to murder? Then a pleader speaking, Maharaj, look that man devotee. He wanted to kill you, na? Yes? He wanted to kill you? Yes, na? You look at him. Maharaj looking at him. Looking at him. Maharaj looking, looking at him with full compassion. Looking at him. After that, in front of judge speaking, no. What do you say? He was detected. He wanted to kill you. Maharaj said, no, it's not. Maharaj wanted to save him. Then, High Court judge could not do anything. Because Maharaj himself saying, now you know, now you understand what a devotee who is, who can be a devotee. 
like Prabhupada, our Guru Maharaj, so much insult, so much attack, but still they are not. My Guru Maharaj was broken head, opponent party, unnecessary. Guru Maharaj speaking, I am innocent all the way from my birth, but still they take one rod and break my head, all blood coming. But still I never protest them. So devotee, if you want to become devotee, try to get preparation. Try to get so that Bhagavan can burn you, you can survive. I give the example first of all. You have to bear at any condition, at any situation, you can go and spearing Harikata. This situation cannot permit you to speak Harikata. Impossible. But so you can speak Harikata. Because Harikata is your life. So if you like to become devotee, I give you warning. You try to get maturity. So that Bhagavan can burn you and you can survive. Then you can get this bhakti. Not that only Tilak, Mala and this one. Not that. All you will have to. You have to be here. So you see, the sloka I started with is really very important. Now you think, so long as Pallad Maharaj, so long as Srila Pallad Maharaj, a very near and dear one. Very near and dear one. Very near and dear one. As soon as he started speaking about Bhakti, Kalpya Bhas. This is the nature. This is the nature of this society. Then you want to kill him. Pohladma has first you told, I already discussed. Tat sadhu manne asura varjade hina sada samud vignadhiya masad gura hitva tupatam grihamand kupam banam gatha yad harimas. Second, second time when he came, savanam kirtanam vishnas paranam pada sevanam archanam 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 bandhanam dasham shaksham atmani vedanam all six, nine fold of bhakti. Then it was out of out of control. Hiranya Gosibu was just out of control because why is speaking about pure bhakti? Why is speaking about? Why is not speaking lie to me? I like to hear lie. I like to hear new new philosophy which can give me, I mean, support my passive karma. I like to hear all nice, nice philosophy which can give my supporting of my passive karma inside heart. That's why Gorgisadda Bhaj Maharaj, one devotee coming from that side of river, paying Dandava, where from you are coming? I'm coming from that side of river. There I'm hearing in a Brahma Gita, very nice discourse on Bhagavatam. Brahma Gita. Baba Yama said, don't go there. Why? There are Harikatha going on. Very nice Harikatha. Oh, very nice. Don't go there. It's not Harikatha. <laughs> People rolling down on ground out of ecstasy. It's not ecstasy. They have passive karma inside heart. They like to get some backing by hearing the secret Leela of Radha Govinda. They like to match that Leela with their own dirty life. Don't go there. What do you say? Yes. He is not speaking Bhagavad Katha. He is speaking money, 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 sweet and then sweeter than honey. He is speaking. Don't go there. And if possible, you go there and dig that place, 20 hands, and throw, that mud is contaminated, and fill up with a new Ganga mud. But we are hearing lecture from big, big lecturer. Main problem is that, main problem is that, that people, they have no basic idea about A, B, C of Bhagavad A, B, C, D, basic idea. So it's very easy to make fool of them. Very easy to make fool of them. Very easy. Even they have no A, B, C, D idea. Only speak Hare Krishna, that's one mala, Hare Krishna. They can take, you know, outside this and that and they enjoy their life. Devotional life also you can enjoy very much. Yes, 
If you like to enjoy your devotional life, then you can look some people. Devotional life is very easy to enjoy. It is very easy. In material dress, material form, you cannot enjoy. With devotee, clothes if you take, it's very easy to enjoy. Because people believe you. And you can enjoy whole life. Devotional life is so easy to cheat people and enjoy. Enjoying mood you can get very big enjoyment. Even outside people, they're giving labor day and night and getting 400 rupees after 12 hours of job, 8 hours. But you are getting very free. Can you show me such a devotee who is taking money, anything, but not thinking it is not my money? It is Bhagavan money. They can use it. They like to utilize all for seva. Very rare, very rare. Whenever money comes, they think my money. Money coming is my, my money. I put in bank, this, that, enjoy. So Bhagavan, he started speaking, very appropriate. Dharma, Satya, Dayo, Peto, Vidyava, Tapasan, Nitaha, Mad bhaktya petam atmanam no sammak punatihi punatihi. My devo devotional mood, my I mean devotion all to my lotus feet can purify a devotee so nicely that even those who are having dharma, satta, vidya, tapasya, everything, everything there, but you can do ishta, ishta purti, you know, ishta purti. Ishta purti is Sanskrit word. Ishta purti means you have money, you are arranging one pond for public, you want, arrange one uh, well, well to get water so that water can come, this kind of thing. It's called ishta purti, for public facility. Those beasts coming, for them here in Vrindavan you can find so many water, beasts can come. Is called Ishtapurti. So, by you can try yourself by following general dharma. Yesterday, I already explained Jodi is not following general dharma, and our uh, Gokarnaji Maharaj never wanted to mean the general dharma, wanted to Bhagavad dharma. Uh, without Bhagavad dharma, nowhere you can apply Sri. Suppose you are not following Bhagavad dharma, I cannot use Sri. Sri, I cannot. Suppose I am going to write one letter to Mayavadi, I cannot write C. I cannot write C. Externally I can show. Many Mayavadi writing me letter. You can go through magazine there. Big Mayavadi, famous. Four lakhs cow taking care. After watching my Gomata book, they invite me, go Joggo. Mane, so much big Jagya, where tons of ghee you need to apply. They invite me. I don't go. They wrote me letter. Letters there. <coughs> so I know they are Mayabadi. I don't write. So anyway, this way you see, Sri you cannot use. Sri means Shilata. Sri means Sandarjo. Sri means you have connection with Radharani. This is a secret Siddhanta. Wherever you, you see, Unknowingly you are using Sri, but actually I think without devotee, Gauriya devotee or I mean Bhagavad Bhakta Joa, you cannot apply Sri. Here and there you cannot see. Sri means have some linkage with Radharani. But Sri, only Radharani is a complete Sri. Even Lakshmi Devi is not complete Sri. If I want to say who is the original Lakshmi, then we can say Radharani. Radharani is original Lakshmi. Originally Radhani, all Lakshmi coming. So this, so you can have, you are doing so many dharma, general dharma, Vedic dharma. You are following Vedic dharma, doing jagga, soma jagya, puja, so many things. You, you are also, a truthfulness is there with you. Truth, you never speak lie. Truthfulness is Mayavadi. A truthfulness so much, Bhav Reva. They are speaking lie. But basically they are speaking lie. <laughs> basically they are speaking lie. But in general they are not speaking lie. 
I become Brahma. That is right. Number one liar. So after that, what happens? Bolchen, Vidya, you can have Vidya. Or Tapasya, you can have. Like Sri and Mahaprabhu already told, you know, Suklambar Brahmachari, who is drinking milk only. Ah. One day he wanted to express desire to watch the Sankirtan Rasa. He wanted to. This much. He has done. His whole life is so pure. Even mentally, no contamination. Be careful. Whole life so pure. Even mental, con mental contamination is not there. But still. He wanted to express a desire to watch Sankirtan Ras. When Mahaprabhu came to know, Mahaprabhu became fire. What do you think? You are drinking milk. You are doing so much as sweeties and finances. You think you can see my Ras? Eh? What do you think? Those demons are also doing as and finances. So much. Even demigods they cannot do. Shankar Bhagavan doing a study. But it is written in Bhagavatam, Hiranyagasipu done this kind of no bhutam na bhavishyati. In the past, nobody done, or in the future, nobody can do. No bhutam na bhavishyati. This kind of, but still Mahaprabhu speaking, those demons are also doing. Brikasur has done so much as and Pinas. You can do it, you cannot do it. Never. Here in Nagasibu, Ravan. So what? So what? They're getting bhakti? They're getting one drop of bhakti? Eh? Not. So don't think bhakti is very cheap. Don't think bhakti is so cheap. You can, ah, you can do some and get now. You will have to wait and watch. The only way, the only way I can, you can open all the Upadesha Amrita of Prabhupada. I can so many times Prabhupada repeatedly speaking. Bhakata seva paramasiddhi premlati karamulo. Ekadushi kirtan. Two kirtan ekadushi. One is this, another is that. Two kirtans are there. Sihari basare hari kirtan avidhan. This is one kirtan. Second kirtan this, two kirtan you can do. Follow, Pobad. Here kirtan bhakti muntak writing. Bhakata seva parama siddhi prem lotikar mula. The basic root cause of your prema, which is a rare to get. When you can get prema bhakti, and you have you, you already realize of sarup, but not finally getting. You realize. Mentally you are doing. That time you are getting siddhi, sarup siddhi. After that we can leave. That time you can go on doing bhajan. By remembering a sarup and related related seva in Vrindavan, whatever. I mean those exalted, not for you and me. Finally, when they leave body, they can be given the chance to enter into eternal self, finally. But those eternal parshad of Gauranga, we are not going to. They are eternal parshad. In one form they are serving here, another form, Radha Govinda. So Bhagavan going to, repeatedly speaking, what you think? You are drinking milk, that cannot, that cannot be the only reason for why you can have the opportunity to have. See my you are drinking milk, so you can see me, so you can get me, my rasa, rasa kirtan rasa, not so easy. So, Bhagavan is speaking, okay, any devotee, previously he was a very dirty man, very dirty, low caste, no problem. Bhagavan speaking, that mad bhaktya petam atmanam no samyak punatihi. But actually, my devotion can purify him. 
And after that, Bhagavan speaking, Katham Bina Rum Harsham Dravata Chetasa Bina Bina Ananda Sukalaya Shuddhed Bhakta Vinasayo. Shuddhed Bhakta Vinasayo. Right? What Bhagavan speaking? Katham Bina. How? How without your hair tips standing here or body here? Standing trips. Stand. Kathang bina rum harsho. Rum harsho means romani. Romani means far. Body here. Rum harsho means rum harsho means this body here. When laughing. Harsho means laugh. Like the name of Rum Harshan Sutta. Who was the first speaker of Bhagavatam before Sutta Dev Goswami? He is the son of a father of Sutta Dev Goswami. He was first the number one speaker of Bhagavatam. And Rum Harshan Sutta. Rum Harshan Sutta. Rum Harshan means his hair standing on trips and laughing. Ha ha ha. All hair, body trips. Yes, all body trips, laughing after singing the glories of Bhagavan. That's why Romani Harsho Jasso Jayate Iti Rama Romo Harsan. Romo Harsan means Romo Harsani Jayate. Rom all tips laughing. My standing on here, feeling some reaction. That's all. His name was Romo Harsha. Bhagavan speaking, Katham Bina Romo Harsam Dravata Chetasa. How you can expect without the heart meltdown, without the heart meltdown, and here tip stand. Kathang bina rum harsam dovata drabata chetasa bina. Bina ananda sukhala. When tears run, not rolling down her cheeks after hearing Harikatha and Kirtan doing now, how you can expect a man can purify himself? There is a symptom. There is a symptom. So, without this kind of reaction, Bhagavan speaking, without this kind of reaction, you cannot expect somebody can purify. These are, there is a symptom. We have seen, we have seen in the life of Guru Bhasidharma, our Guru Maharaj, whenever one topic is coming, you are giving pain to Bhagavan, Guru Maharaj automatically crying. We have seen. Cannot speak out. Same thing with Prabhupada. At the bank, today I was also discussing the final touch of, you know, Raghavatma Chandika. I, I was feeling very sad because I am speaking so secret thing, I am not qualified. I am also in front of public. So anyway, I was controlling my speech within some limit. Uh, there, Popa at the bank of Radha Kunda, at the bank of Radha Kunda. Popa was explaining Upadesha Amrita. Tanna Marupa Charita Disukirta Nanu Smritta Kamena Rasana Manasi Niyajya Tishta Navajeta Dhanuragi Jananugami Kalam Naid Akhilam Iti Upadesha Sahara. This Popa was explaining. In course of explanation, somehow the name of Radharani came. Then Prabhupada started shaking. Prabhupada couldn't speak. He stopped his speech. Voice choked up. He kept silence. And somehow shake up himself. This is the condition of a pure devotee. This is the condition of here after hearing all the secret lila of Chaitanya Mahaprabhu. So my Siddhanta, all our Guru Varga, they are different, you know, effort to preach Shuddha Bhakti called around, all around. In one place I can show you, Papa speaking, we will have to strike, Papa speaking, Upadesha Amrita. Papa speaking, we will have to strike against Maya. We will have to strike against Kali. We will have to strike. We cannot allow the Sahaja can speak about, you know, pure Gauriya devotees and Gauriya Mat. 
If we allow them, we are rascal number one. We can strike them. We can strike and protest and establish pure Siddhanta Vichar. We cannot allow them to preach wrong, but now just opposite. Whoever speaking what? Oh, don't disturb. Let him preach. Let him speak. You speak your own thing and come back. Those who are coming, going outside, some Maharaj told me, this is the present status of preaching. Suppose you are going to preach, suppose Bhakti Bhaiva Puri Goswami is going, Bhakti Bhaiva, he gone from all. He is going to speak. After that, some Sahaja coming and speak all same from Gauri Amal. All rubbish. Oh, they are also clapping, giving money to them. I mean, they don't understand anything, understand nothing. Whoever speaking what, whoever speaking what, let them speak. Don't disturb them. Then you cannot get any place. They can kick you out where you can sleep. They cannot give you place. You are, you are bound to you are bound to submit in front of their lotus feet. You are so big, dirty acharya. You are so big, elevated, dirty acharya. You will have to accept it, whatever they are doing. You are hearing. They are speaking against Baba. You are not, cannot speak anything. If you speak, they can provide a kick. You can come to India and fall down. Yeah. Then, who can give you money? You need money, na? Money is your God, na? Then, money is your God. We know money is your God. So, you are getting money. Money is your God. Somebody, somehow, out of a car seat, they are speaking, money is the second God. I say, they are speaking second God. It is their highness. It is the highness they are going to speak that money is the second God. Actually, they wanted to speak that money is the first God. But they cannot speak. I have some. Anyway, I have to control themselves. It is their highness. They, at least they are speaking money is the second God. Actually, money is the first God in their life. Not second God. We don't believe. So, Bhagavan speaking. So now you are growing experience about provided you remember and apply in your life. Provided you remember and apply in your own life. Otherwise you cannot get any result. So Bhagavan speaking practical thing. If you are not going to watch any idealism, anything, only external, all decoration. This is not devotion. But people think this is Jews. So Bhagavan speaking, Kathang Bina Rum Harsam, Kathang Bina Rum Harsam Dravata Chetasa Bina, Bina Ananda Sruk Kalaya, Shuddhid Bhaktya Benasayu. How they can purify their heart? How they can purify their heart? They cannot purify. Anyhow, they have some astuity and finances, they have knowledgeable person, they are, okay, the Vidya, they are, they are doing some donation, these are dharma, shatta, they are truthfulness, Vidya, tapasya. Nothing can purify so much as Bhakti can do. After that, Bhagavan speaking, Bhagavad Gadaya Dravati Yasa Chitta Chityam Rodati Abhiknam Hasati Kachicha Bilajo Udgayati Eh Nitati Here is printing mistake, everywhere printing mistake. Eh Nitate Cha Madhakti Yukto Bhuvanam Panati. Right? Yes, yes, yes. But actually, Sanskrit is some mistake, no? then automatically tongue can stop. Because you, are, you cannot match. When it is okay, na, then tongue can, like uh, one rhythm. So then when my, my tongue stands, I watch it, some mistake. Mistake means some light printing or some. So, Bhagavad Gadaya Dravati Yasachittam Radhati Aviknam Hasati Kachit And Bilajya Udgayati Nittati Cha Madhvakti Yukta Bhuvanam Panati. The whole world can purify such a devotee. Such a devotee 
who is always cannot speak, his voice choked up. Like Uddhav going to speak about Bhagavan, some choked up, cannot speak. Like Prabhupada I told. And heart melt up. And shedding tears, abhiknam, continuously shedding tears by the topics of Bhagavan. Follow. After that, Rodati Abhiknam, Hashati Kachicha. Sometimes you don't know the symptom of you. In a lonely room, nobody there. <laughs> they started laughing. Sometimes they are speaking something alone, like a mad. You can think they are crazy, but they are not crazy. So, what happens? Sometimes, Udgayati shout, is shouting and singing, you know, Nittati, something dancing. What is the condition of Pallad Maharaj? Already you know. A condition of Pallad Bhala. Sometimes dancing, sometimes crying. Ah, ah, ah. This condition of Pallad Maharaj is written. So, this kind of devotee, Bhagavan speaking, if such a devotee can find, they can purify the whole world. They can purify the whole world. They need not speak any word. Gaur Kishar Baba, Gaur Kishar Babaji Maharaj need not speak any lecture. Only you can put Babaji Maharaj in front of public. Lacks of public watching Babaji Maharaj. By watching Babaji Maharaj, you can purify. By watching Bhangshidas Babaji Maharaj, Bhagwandas Babaji Maharaj, such a beautiful. This is called. So, it's very rare, you know. This way, Bhag Gad Gada, Bhag Bachan, Bhag Gad Gada, Dravate, Jasa Chittam, Rodati Abhiknam, Hasati Kachicha, Bilajja Udgayati, Nettati Chamad Bhakti, Yukto Bhavanam Panati. Bhagavan speaking, such devotee, Udhav, you know, no. They are going to purify the world. Only by darshan. Tomorrow I can discuss. One pure devotee, he need not speak anything. One pure devotee, in front of thousands of so-called devotee and men, without speaking even a single word, can teach so many things to them. Without speaking a single word, they can teach so many things to them. You don't understand. Tomorrow I can explain. Without speaking even a single word, by standing there, they can teach so many things to them. Only by their darshan. You cannot understand the meaning. Such a power one, you know, pure devotee having. Tomorrow I can give example, such example, that one pure devotee, he need not speak. He can speak or cannot speak. But it not a, he is not bound to speak anything to you. He can speak, cannot speak. But by giving darshan, darshane pavitra karo eito margun. Darshane pavitra karo, Ganga, if you take bath, after you can feel. And by watching a pure devotee, like, the, like all the symptoms spoken by Krishna to Uddhav. Uddhav, there is a condition. They can purify the whole world. They can purify the whole world. So, after that, we can discuss the two sloka again tomorrow. 25 number, Bhagavan speaking. Jatha Agnina, Jatha Agnina, Hema Malam, Hema Malam, Jahatri, Dhatmam, Punaha, Shang, Bhajati, Charupam, Atma, Chakarman, Shayam, Bidhuyo, Madhbhakti, Yogena, eh? Bhajati, Athomam. Each and everybody you can understand. Yatha, Ognina, by Ognina mean by Agni. If one piece of gold is burnt up, Jatha Agnina, Hema Malam, Jahati, Dhatmam, Punaha, Shwam, Bhajati, Charupam, Atma, Chakaraman, Shayam, Vidhuyo, Madhbhakti, Yogena, Bhajati, Athomam. This Bhagavan can speak. So many things. How by Bhakti, 
one can purify, I can speak tomorrow, today actually. So, Naishang Mati Stavat Urukramangi Sprisha Tanartap Gamo Jadarto Mahiyasam Padara Jovisekam Niskin Chananam Nabrinito Javat Vanchakal Padavasiki Pasin Patitanam Pavana Pavish. We arrange function there and here. I go to market personally after online Harikatha by so much sweet different kind of for devotees. And tomorrow, because there is extra money, no? I thought what I can do. There I give, after that I can give Pranami. Still extra. I say, okay. So tomorrow, I can speak Harikatha morning time. Because people can come after by one. I cannot come to speak Harikatha evening time. So morning time, Around 11, 7, I can start and finish within one and a half hour. Morning high. Yeah, after that, I can go bigger. Because if I go after, suppose people come in from outside to meet me, I cannot say, you stay, I can go. It's very bad. I was arranging one function there. So many people can take prasad. So if they like to talk with me, I cannot say. But before Harikatha, some disturbance is not good. I go and take one. 